I like to talk about um, being invited to places as a single versus married people. More, more towards, you know, your friends you grew up with that got married and you're still single. What happens when they organize things, gatherings for other married people and they don't invite you? It happens, actually, uh, quite commonly. Um, you know, I've, I've had, I've noticed that with my situation, I really literally have only two friends in my circle that are single. The rest are all married. And the married people I noticed I don't see as often as the single people. Naturally normally I guess it's 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 a normal thing that married people stick together with married people right so when they organize events and gatherings birthdays whatever it is they tend to invite married people only um, I've noticed that <clears throat> I don't get invitations to gatherings from those married friends anymore as much as I do the single friends um, to the point where I would see them once a year, my married friends, you know. Um, I'm not pinpointing anyone here. I don't know if any of you, my friends, are watching this, but it's not any, it's not towards any of you. It's just a, uh, an observation I'm making as a single person, how I don't get to see my close friends that are married anymore as much. I don't receive a lot of invitations to go over their house for dinner, uh, for birthdays, for anything, you know, even their kids' birthdays where they would invite the parents of the other kids and stuff. Um, anything really that has to do with gathering, I don't, I don't get those invitations and I get it. I get it. I mean, I'm sure once I'll be married, I, I will understand and see how maybe inviting my single friends may be uncomfortable for them or me. I don't know. Uh, I am one that I wouldn't be uncomfortable going to a gathering with married people. I've done it before. I've been I've been invited before to gatherings of married people where I was the only one single. It's doable, you know, it's, um, I'm still human, I'm still uh, someone that can gather, <laughs> but I guess it's the dynamic that is different, and some people just assume right away that us single people would not feel comfortable around you married people, I don't know, or vice versa, so maybe the married people don't feel comfortable having single people around, maybe they don't know how to mingle with them with us <laughs> anyways i don't know but is this something you guys go through and also i'm talking to you married people is this something that you f go through as a married person D do you feel uncomfortable inviting your single friends over when you have gatherings with other married people is this a thing i'd like to know um and for the for all of my friends listening to this, I have absolutely no problem being invited to something where you feel I don't belong. <laughs> like a a birthday of your kids where all the families are gathering. I don't mind showing up being the single person with no kids there. Um, <clears throat> or if you have dinner, if you're gonna make dinner and invite married people, like a double date or a triple date or whatever, I wouldn't mind being invited and be the only one not married there. You know, it's not, it's not an insecurity of mine to be around married people, if that makes any sense. It used to be, I have to be honest, I used to be very, not, I guess, jealous or uncomfortable or insecure being around married people because I would be like, what about me? 
I'm unmarried. It, it used to be like a shame for me or, uh, you know, an embarrassment. So I, I was that person for sure. So I get it, but I'm not anymore. <laughs> I could care less. I'm very comfortable being single, being around married people, um, being the oddball, you know, I don't feel the shame like I used to. I don't, <clears throat> yeah, so just an observation. I'd like to know what you guys think about that and if you're going through that as well. And that's pretty much it. Let me know what you think. Thanks for listening. Bye.